Many of us will remember this fall because we went from pretty mild Indian summer temperatures in October to extreme winter temperatures in early November, well below zero in many communities. And we're beginning to see uh, damage to our evergreen trees, which we all think of as hardy for our region, but they can't always take extreme temperature changes because they haven't gone through the complete dormancy changeover process that quickly in the season. One of the things that we can combat um, future pest damage and the stress on the trees is to do some winter watering. We tend to promote that every year and we recommend that especially your evergreens get watered every winter. Usually we tell you to water anytime the temperatures are above 45 degrees and the wind's not blowing, which ends up being about once a month through the winter months. The tree roots are in the top 12 to 18 inches of your soil for the most part. Almost all of their roots are gonna be in the top three foot of the soil. And in comparison to our lawns, their roots are only in the top six to eight inches of the soil. So we're gonna be watering much deeper to keep the trees healthy than we do when we're watering our lawns. One of the things that you wanna make sure that you do is to keep a garden hose handy to do this winter watering. And then every time that you water, you wanna make sure that you disconnect the hose and drain it so that you don't have any hoses freezing up. For the University of Wyoming Extension, this is Donna Hoffman and you're watching From the Ground Up.